everyone, it's me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to part 12 of The Sims 3 Supernatural. Uh, last time we left off, Odessa was just chilling out with a ghost and a zombie in the garden. Um, Luke was at work, Xander was eating some waffles on the couch when there was a freaking dining room, <laughs> well opened, and his tongue's out of his mouth, look, hey, <laughs> um, and Raven was asleep. So let's go ahead and jump back into the game. Also, for those who knew I was sick, um, let me actually tell you the story of that, okay? Uh, story of me being sick. I went to bed at 8 p.m. because I felt that sick. Woke up around 10.30 p.m. and I thought my brain was going to explode. I thought my brain was literally going to explode. I had the worst migraine I've ever had. To the point where my mother had to literally, like, get, like, a lot of, like, medicine and crap out. I, I don't even know. I usually don't get them that bad, and that was just really creepy. But anyways, um, we're gonna go ahead and tend to our garden instead of talking to this ghost. We're gonna harvest a lot of our... A lot of our stuff, um, uh. <laughs> and Bone Hilda is out of her cage or whatever she you would call this. I don't even know. She's just gonna go ahead and clean. And I think Raven's carpool's here. If I'm correct. No, that's Xander's. Yes, that's Xander's. Um. But we're going to have Raven actually just go ahead and wake up already. She's been asleep for quite some time. And she's going to use the toilet and take a shower. She's going to research alchemy for a little while also. Um, and Odessa, Odessa is just fixing up the garden. And Luke should be coming home from work kind of soon. What is that noise? some creepy noises going on in this house. <laughs> um, so yes, I'm going to go ahead and speed this all up. Well, everything kind of just continuously happens. Oh, look, we're right by like a little lake and a bunch of mountains. How pretty. Okay, here we go. Raven is now studying some alchemy, and I absolutely love alchemy in this game. It's so much fun. Vial of Potent Bliss. Hmm. We're going to go ahead and mix an elixir. Let's see. The one she just learned how to make is find long-lasting happiness, no matter how miserable or boring life really is. Hmm. I'm not sure what I want. There's nothing I want just yet. Um, I know we got her some books, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah. She's just gonna go ahead and read some of them. And we're actually going to have Odessa, once she's done taking care of her garden, um, I think I'm going to have her head to go get some fish. Okay, they need to chill out over there. Mm-hmm. I'm talking to you, little zombies. Chill out. Okay, so, <laughs> Raven just took care of that, and I'm actually going to have her research a little bit more, just because she has some spare time on... Um, honor because today was her day off. So it's probably a good idea for us to kind of just um, work on her alchemy skill. She just learned personality adjuster. Hmm. So I'm just going to have her continuously research for a little while. She's in a good mood and she has a lot of time on her hand. So. So, um, we are going to actually turn the lights on in here. Uh, Luke's on his way home, and he is on call today also, so he might have to go in sometime today. Um, she just learned a recipe for injurgating elixir? Don't know what that is, but, um, hey. Keep going, girl. Keep researching. <laughs> 
Alright, Luke is home, and he is, like, in a terrible mood. He's like, let me go to bed. I don't want to hear anything about anyone. He is exhausted. So I'm just going to let him head to bed. Um, right, like I said, I wanted Odessa to go out and, um, go fishing, but it's late, so never mind. And it says, congratulations, Raven has just improved her alchemy skill to level 6. Raven now has a chance to create an extra elixir each mix attempt. Cool. And Xander will be coming home and very shortly, and uh, then I'll give um, Xander and Odessa some time. But Xander is very tired, so uh, we'll have Raven go ahead and mix an elixir. Um, and maybe make one for sleepiness? Is there one to get rid of sleepiness, maybe? No? What is this? Ah, oh, there's only ones to make your sims go to sleep, but I don't want that. Man! <laughs> I don't want that! Ah, oh, come on, man. Um, 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 ha, ma, ma. Zombification. We, you know what? We're just going to go ahead and actually head to the bookstore really fast. And let's see what type of um, stuff we can get now. Like, new books. Because she's a level 6 now. And that's a lot different than a level, I think, when we came here. She's like a level 3 or 4. So we're going to have her actually run in here really fast and see what we can get. Uh, see if there's anything new. Uh, let's see. Zombification. This is a level 9 book, but we have a little bit of extra money, so... We're spending around 1,000 simoleons here to get two books. One for the Tragic Clown and one for Zombification. And... Alright. Just spent a good wad of money here. But it's worth it. And Xander's on his way home. And some people have been telling me for um, Raven to study uh, or work on her um, broom skills or whatever so she can do broom competitions. And I want to do that. I just don't know um, where is somewhere we can do this. Like, is there a place nearby that she can, like, practice? Because I know they have, like, little stations for it. I just... <gasps> There's a unicorn! Just where's the unicorn? Where's the unicorn? There it is! Yay! There's so many unicorns that have been popping up in my game. Okay, where is it? There it is. So many unicorns have been popping up in my game. And I love to find them because they always look different. Oh, it's the same one with the little beard. Oh, and he has his mouth open. Oh, God, I got a picture of that. Yay. Yay. He has his mouth open. Yes. Yes. Life, my life goal is, like, complete right there. Um, I'm trying to find the stupid freaking thing where we can practice but I don't think there is one or maybe I just can't find it it's probably what it is no this is a parking lot um I don't want to spend freaking all this time looking for this right here yes 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 <laughs> so we're gonna actually have her come here and stunt ride instead of heading home I'm just gonna have her head here and now she will start studying on her little broom which I did buy her the most expensive broom just so she can have that opportunity to do really well I'm just gonna head to the house real fast and actually just uh, put Xander to bed because he's exhausted and I'll uh, have Odessa um, um, go ahead and uh, head to bed as well and we'll just go with Raven 
to the little thingy my bobber <laughs> whatever this is right now it just looks like a bunch of sticks and stuff all right she's gonna get in her little magical broom <laughs> that's so cool I love it she's doing some stunts and stuff There's a deer somewhere nearby. That's cool. Alright. I'm quickly going to have her um, do a joy ride. And then do another stunt ride. She's just going to do these two and then actually head home and head to bed. Because she has work. But she doesn't go to work till 1pm. So. Alright, now she's going to go ahead and head home. That was a lot of fun, so we will definitely be back. Because um, this was cute. I never really saw this too much. Um, except like in the commercials for this and stuff. So, we will definitely have to do it more often. Oh wait, hold on, hold on. There's fireflies. Catch some. Catch some fireflies. Okay. So, she's going to actually head home now. Or should she just catch those fireflies? And there's a zombie here. Mm, of course. So we're going to head home and uh, head to bed, I suppose. Just send her to bed. On her little mystical broom. <laughs> and then I think all our other sims should be waking up within the few hours and everything anyways. So she's just going to head to bed. And I will see you guys when somebody wakes up. Okay, and Luke is awake, and so is Nardessa. Um, so Luke, Mr. Luke, is very thirsty for some plasma, so he will go ahead and um, have some plasma. And all that good stuff, he will have some plasma. Odessa um, is going to go feed Sammy. <laughs> and, yeah. Oh, Odessa. Odessa, like I said, will go feed Sammy <laughs> and pay the bills after she's done with that. And then she will, I guess, have some apple pancakes this morning. And just devour her food. <laughs> Ooh, what the heck? Oh, Luke. Oh, Luke. Ooh, just had a hiccup. So he has work in three hours, and then he actually has, um, then he has two days off, and part of his job is having to study people's medical journals, and he actually brought one home today, so he's about to just go ahead and read his journal for his patients until his work carpool comes, and I think that's good. And I actually want to go ahead and drag some of the things from Xander's inventory into Raven's. Um, just because he has like gems and stuff and like gold that he definitely does not need. Um, like Raven does. So go ahead and take that from him. And he has some like little animals and stuff. So we'll go ahead and take that. All his little stuff in his inventory. Ooh, some of the stuff's worth like a thousand simoleons. I'm actually going to go ahead and uh, sell some of that stuff. Uh, where is it? I think it was a beetle. Yeah. It was this freaking little thing. We're gonna go ahead and sell that. It's like a thousand simoleons. One thousand six hundred and eighty-one simoleons. Okay, that made up for the books we just bought. Cool. Um, we have tons of apples. Tons of apples. Oh, and that's Luke's carpool, so he's going to go ahead and head to work now. And Luke Xander's awake! Yay! Xander's awake. He's never awake. Um, he'll go ahead and uh, I'll give him a couple of fishies to snack on. Uh... 
And then he's actually gonna, um, Odessa's gonna throw something at him. Uh, he's, she's gonna throw it at Xander. So they come better friends faster. Many relationships have been started with the potent liquids. In this case, Odessa Faro used the friendship elixir to become friends with Xander Ophel. Oh, Yay! She's gonna ask him to protect her and just be cute. Cute little romance. <laughs> she wants to kiss him? <gasps> I love it. They're good friends. They like each other. <laughs> Darkly. They like each other. <laughs> he wants to kiss Odessa too, so I'll lock that in. Raven's just like, whoa. <laughs> oh, they have the option for their first kiss. Kiss, kiss. Oh, oh, yay! 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 <laughs> I'm gonna have him, um, kiss her. Oh, shoot! Oh, sh there is a lot of things in here for him to do to her. Alright. First things first is propo propose going steady as they're being extremely irresistible right now. <laughs> So now they're officially dating. Yay. And he will kiss her. And I want a picture of this so I can post this on my Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Supernatural love. And um they are going to go uh, try for a baby. Uh -huh. I know they're not even engaged yet, but I like to do things backwards, FYI, so why not? I mean, why not? Uh, Raven, uh, get out of here. We are trying to do something, and you interrupted. Go for it again, guys. I guess I guess it's just a no. I guess it's just a no. All right, whatever. Mhm. Mm They're so cute. <laughs> um. There you go. Go try for a baby with Xander in the shower, generation style. Holla. A groovy grown Freddy J. She's like, I'm coming in. Whoa! 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 Nothing happened. Too bad. Oh well. Um. So. <laughs> She's going to go uh, send to her garden and fertilize the best fertilizers. And Xander has the day off. Which is, I guess, good. Uh-huh. <laughs> Bone Hilda is just walking around everywhere. Everywhere. So I'm going to have Xander actually go ahead and use the restroom and... I'll let him eat another fish, um, and he will also go ahead and do some chin-ups uh, for a little while. Uh, the ghost just went through a toilet, so...
Okay, this ghost needs to seriously get out. Um. And we haven't really taken care of our little bees and stuff lately, but whatever. Um, um, um. We can actually afford the gem cutter. And I think that's just what we'll do, is get the gem cutter. And, yeah, that can definitely help us out. Get that little gem cutter. Um, here it is. No, that's an alchemy. Here it is. The gem cutter, right? Yes. Uh, we'll put that on our porch, like everything else. And, yes. Okay, guys, so that's the end of this part, and... I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.